Trent Alexander-Arnold insisted the blame should not lay at Alisson's door for Leicester's gift of a goal against Liverpool. The Foxes quickly overturned a 1-0 deficit to lead 3-1 just seven minutes after equalising in Saturday's clash at the King. Liverpool had looked in control following the Hamid Salah's opener, but their afternoon quickly fell apart, with Leicester's second goal the talking point of them. Alisson came rushing miles out of his goal to intercept a long ball but made a real hash of it along with teammate Ozan Kabak to give Jamie Vardy an easy finish into an end. While it was a clear mix-up between the pair, Allison could have avoided the situation, just a week after his two clangers against Man City. But Alexander-Arnold believes the goal was a result of pure bad luck. Second goal, one in a million, really, lack of communication. No one to blame there. His view was similar to that of his manager, who felt it was largely due to debutante Kabak not being familiar with Alisson's traits. Before the game we all knew Ozan is a really good player and after we know that as well, but what we knew before the game is he is not really used to all the things we usually do, Jurgen. Get the latest Liverpool news straight into your inbox. Liverpool are keen to repeat last season's success, and you don't want to miss a thing, surely? From all of Liverpool's updates to the must-read red stories, Get them straight to your inbox without fuss by signing up for the fantastic Mirror Football newsletter. It's been an extremely interesting start to the season for Jurgen. They got their title defense off to a shaky start as they edged out a seven-goal thriller against Leeds, before going on to concede at seven and a hammering by a Virgil van Dijk season was ended by injury in the 2-2 draw at Everton, leaving the title favorites looking far less secure at the back especially with the Lissons injury worries too. But Terry's no slowing down in what is going to be a busy campaign, with Klopp ensuring his men continue at full pace as they bid for more. The easiest way to keep up with everything going on at Anfield? It's by sign. Put your email at the top of this article or follow the instructions. When you play with Ali you know he's quite offensive-minded, comes out of his goal. In this situation it was a misunderstanding it can happen. When you are new together usually these things happen in pre- We don't have that so that's why it happened. That was the second goal. Leicester's equaliser had come about under contentious circumstances, with James Madison's free kick surviving a VAR check for offside, before quick-fire goals from Vardy and Harvey Barnes who was to blame for Leicester's second goal. Have your say below. It was quite a capitulation from Liverpool, who had looked good value for the victory before that, but Alexander-Arnold admitted they simply, I think, 70, 75 minutes, we were outstanding, up there with one of our best performances, he had a counter-pressing taking the ball off them for fun. They couldn't really, really, really top drawer from us. And then the tables turned. They put the game to bed in a matter of five, ten minutes. That's football. It happens so quickly, it just happens. In the moment, Webb crumbled at the end.